Hey everyone, May is in the book, so I wanted to take a couple minutes to show you all of our trade results for the month of May. Uh, you might have noticed April is missing. I, I didn't post a video last month because we've been restructuring how we deliver our alerts and we're, we're sending out a ton more trade opportunities. And so we've been trying to figure out uh, exactly how we want to do this. And so I think we've kind of got it figured out. So I wanted to report on May and going forward, we'll have a lot more detailed analysis as, as we co uh, create some reporting tools uh, to get this out to you all. So with that, let's jump in. First thing is we are going to be re reporting by strategy. So we've been doing a lot of what we call our dynamic calendar spreads, which is a couple of different type of calendar, double calendar type strategies. One of which is our TGIF, which is thank God it's Friday double calendar. We've also got our dynamic double calendar. And so here is our performance on all of our closed calendar trades. Uh, you can see as we go down here, I did, I'll go down to the total. Uh, so total P&L on our calendar trades, a little over 6,700 for the month of May uh, for a total profit percentage of over 6% return on capital use. So our max risk or capital use total for all trades for the month of May was over 112,000. Uh, you can see, you know, some trades were doing about 5,000, 5,000, between five and 10,000. Uh, some a little bit less, got one here for about 1,500. Depends on the strategy and the opportunity. Uh, but most of the time will be between five to 10,000 per position. And you can scale these to as small or as large of a position as you want for your account size, but that's just what we're doing for this, uh, for this portfolio. So uh, nice profit, nice, uh, nice return there. Total of 15 trades, 11 winners and four losers for a winning percentage of 73.33% on that strategy. Next one, short strangles. Only one trade closed. So we had one trade uh, booked a little over $300, uh, $312. Now, these short strangles, it's undefined risk. So uh, the, the, the capital required actually fluctuates throughout the time of the trade. So it's not a, I'm not going to be reporting a percentage gain because that's a little bit difficult to do. But just uh, the, on the reporting, just one trade, $312.50. Uh, we've got several others in the hopper that will be closed for next month. Uh, day trading. So I have not been doing a ton of day trading. Dr. Chad Searcy has been running the day trading live stream where we stream every morning for the first 90 minutes, calling out day trades. Uh, he's doing awesome. We've got two different strategies that he trades. One is called the Mighty 90. Uh, he had six winners, four losers for a total profit of a little over $1,100 there. And then the runner strategy. Uh, 32 trades, 21 winners, 11 losers, 66% win rate, total profit, a little over 4,600. So total P&L on his day trades for a little over 5,700. Uh, butterfly spreads, uh, a couple different butterfly spread strategies. You can see we've, we had a uh, quite a few trades here. 18 total trades, uh, slightly in the red. We've, obviously, the market was in a kind of a massive downturn. So that hurt us, even though we do have a huge buffer to the downside. Some of them we've got blown out on, so minus 807 on there. But from a percentage standpoint, less than a 2% loss on those. Total buying power used on all of our trades throughout the month, a little over 42,000. 18 trades, 8 winners, 10 losers, winning percentage of a little over 44%. We expect that to turn around, and we've got uh, about, I don't know, 7 or 8 trades currently on that we'll be reporting on next month. Uh, once they get closed out as well. So a little bit of a down month for butterflies, but that's okay. And same thing for Iron Ducks. Uh, Iron Ducks had a, a, a little over a 3% loss on all of our Iron Duck strategies, minus 479 from a, from a dollar, uh, dollar standpoint. But, um, you know, we saw the market just kind of do this all month. So if you can uh, maintain just a small loss or break even during a period like that, uh, you're going to see some some really good gains here uh, in the near future. 62.5% win rate on those trades for this month. And then the other category I kind of just put together uh, as other trades. So we've got, we had uh, five other trades. One was a, what we call a vertigo variation, and the others were long put diagonals. And on those, we booked a total profit of 1,372. 
uh, P&L percentage of a little over 82%. And in fact, that is actually not correct because I didn't have a uh, the, what the max risk on this vertigo was. Uh, so you can kind of disregard the P&L percentage. This, uh, went, that one took a little bit more capital. Still a winner, though, small winner. Uh, so really good trades on those. And these long put uh, diagonals were just directional, adding some short delta into our portfolio, which obviously helped as the market was tanking this month. So five total trades, four winners, one loser, 80% win rate on those others. Uh, the other category here that I'm kind of classifying as other is our NTT, Navigation Trend Trading. So I do some trades with options on stocks, and I'm getting ready to segment those over to a separate account. But I do so many trades that just trying to report on those is, is a little bit problematic. So I'm not even reporting on the option trades here. However, I do have a separate account just for the micro futures that I trade with this strategy. And so you can see for the month of May on those, uh, total P&L a little over 4,600, win rate of almost 57%, uh, minus minus fees and commissions, so net P&L of a little over 4,500. Uh, you can see I did take a decent sized loss on one of those of over 2,200, which hurt that performance a little bit. You can see my max run up uh, was up over $7,600 at one point on those NTT trades, but ended the month uh, up a little over 4,500. So uh, I'll take it anyway. Uh, so those are all the different closed trades that we had. If you're interested in following along, you can go to navigationtrading.com and click on our pricing page. We've got a couple different memberships. If you're looking for day trading only, where you can attend the live stream and just do some intraday trading, that's 59 bucks a month. Uh, if you want the pro membership for all the other strategies that we uh, put out trades for, it's 179 a month. Or if you want access to both, you can save a bunch of money and just pay annually. It's $12.97 a year. Uh, you get all of the different trades that we talked about as well as access to the day trading. So fun stuff, exciting stuff, very profitable. We look forward to seeing you on the inside and we'll see you next month when we report for the month of June. See you then.